this sort of uh, train line here. Of course, we don't have trains unlocked, so what am I talking about? That's not going to happen right now. So, we've done everything that we can. I think trams will work quite nicely. Why are these guys... Not enough workers. What are you on about? There's plenty of workers. Maybe I could increase these guys' levels. So, to do that, I need parks, which I can't afford. Oh, hot diggity. We are in the... We are in the sink when it comes to these. I'm just going to raise up taxes a little bit. Um, income from residential zones. Interesting. This is nice. I like that they've broken it down a lot more. So, we are not making any money off of buses. At all. <laughs> she. Okay, so we're not making money off of the trams and things. Like, it's not really about making money, it's to reduce traffic and uh, hopefully, I think I think it's done that pretty well. I think so, at least. Yeah, it's nice. Okay. For now, I think it's working quite well. Wow, people are actually getting on the... There's a little walkway in the middle. I never knew they could do that. I didn't know that. So, line details. People aren't really using it, to be fair. Which is a little bit annoying, considering I put it in. But people aren't using it. Never mind. Never mind. That's fine. It ain't like I'm bothered at all. Uh, right. We still have a lot of traffic coming in. It's all for this industrial area. Um, damn. Okay. Well, I think it's time that we put in another area. And uh, this is going to be another suburbs, so I don't know where I'm going to put it. Maybe I could put it in somewhere along here. Oh, no! No, no, no! Oh, shit! <laughs> oh, we, got, we got problems with fires. Shit! Delete all the trees. Don't let them spread. No! We don't want to lose all our trees. All our beautiful, beautiful trees. God damn. Go away, fire. We don't like you. No one likes fire, right? Not in this game. Trying to create a bit of a moat. Between the damn trees. Can you imagine this happening and you just couldn't get out here because it's out of bounds of the map? And the fire just engulfing everything. I mean, it would be nice if trees naturally, like, build themselves back up, if that makes sense. So, like, in real forest fires, they eventually die out. And, um, the forest will eventually grow back. Because, you know, it's, that's what, that's what happens. But, um... In this case, I don't think they grow back, which is really horrible. Like, it just looks horrible. Like, come on, man. Ah, fucking hell. Gosh darn trees. There we go. I think that'll be fine. I thought these were lakes, but they're not. They're fires. 
damn fires. Damn you fires. Damn you fires to hell. Oh, I don't know where I'm going to put in the next area of... Oh no, we've got more burning. Oh, it's stopped. Okay. Okay, that's fine. I'm kind of fine with that. I mean, our forest fire over here has sorted itself out. Okay, that's nice to know. Alright, maybe they won't just spread forever. I kind of don't mind that, actually. Now that I know that it doesn't just wipe everything, and you're fucked. That's nice to know. Good stuff. We got a little desert over here. I don't know whether we should do anything. Is that water? Nah. We could do something with the mountains. Maybe have... Ah. Uh, have like a... Uh, for it, uh, little parky area or something. I don't know. Um, okay, why why are all these people moving out? Abandoned, abandoned, abandoned. Why? Why are people abandoning? Because they need workers. Why? Why you do this? Okay. Right. I need to sort out the budget somehow. And in order to do that. I'm going to stop people from building about here, about there, about here. So we're going to consolidate our workers into this area. Um, and what we're also going to do is we're going to... I don't know whether we should build out. I guess wouldn't look right if this space wasn't filled. I don't know. I don't really know. Um, we're going to have to build somewhere though, so maybe if we build another junction over here. And oh, I don't. I can't. I have no money. What can we do? What can we do about this? Loans. Can we take out a loan? What is the real problem with the the uh, income? Is it is it the transport? Is that what's done it to me? Like, gosh darn it. What is costing us so much? So water's costing us a lot. Transport, yeah, it's, it's a bit of a hit, but it's not the main thing. It's mainly water. And, I mean, we really don't need all of these on yet. That's what's doing it. We've got f like four drain pipes when we only really need two. And the same over here. We can just turn one of these off. Sorted. Will that sort the budget? Will that even out the book? No. Yeah? Maybe? Please. Sort out the budget. I can also just... Uh, Ah, oh, shit. Right. I'm going to turn this one off, because we don't really need it. We have enough power. Uh, in fact, I might just get rid of it. Whatever. Um, we need to start making money and fast and to do that we need more residential areas or improve these ones so let's click on this and let's see how people are happy average land value zone district zone buildings in districts okay um So what we could do, perhaps, is have some policies. Well, you can't do... Yeah, dang it! 
what? What can I do to get out of this hole? Um, why are our expenses so high? We just need to raise the taxes. I think that's the only way to do it. I'll raise them to 11% and see how that does. Still not doing anything. Okay, well we need to we need to do something. So I'm going to turn off. How many people are actually using transportation? 71 a week? Fine. We won't we won't have them. Just turn them off. Don't allow it. And the costs are going down, and we are feasible again. People are just going to have to walk to work. Until we can afford it, people are just going to have to walk to work. I'm sorry. Sorry to everyone who was enjoying using the trams. We cannot afford them. Turns out, trams are damn expensive. <laughs> I didn't realize that. And we'll zone all this industry again. Hopefully it will slowly rebuild. And not just fuck everything up. Um, okay. Cool. Right. Uh, what next? I think we need to... We need to expand out. We need to get to 8,500 people. So we need to quadruple the size of us, our our area. And the only real way I can see us doing that with the money that we have, which we're finally getting back into the into the good stuff. Maybe we could take out a loan. Um five percent interest, ten percent interest. Weekly cost. Well the weekly cost on this one's down. So I'll, I'll get this one. That gives us a load of money big chunk of change people to uh, actually do something so I'm gonna get rid of this little turnaround because we're not using the stupid lines anyway um, not that they're stupid they're very nice I like them but they're very expensive and we just can't afford it so we're gonna build out and I want to go with the waviness but also I want to pack people in so I'm thinking smaller, how's it work, it will have to be smaller areas like this where similar to the uh, industrial area people will just go around the one way system and we can do this and this and we can just pack them in so it's gonna it's kind of gonna mirror our industrial zone I might even build it out a little bit further um, get rid of that lot yeah nice 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 so we need to come up to here across delete that one come over I mean I hate that I'm having to use the uh, gush down tootin grids but we're, we're gonna do it this is the main way to pack them in and we're gonna pack them in we're packing them in people oh shit I have enough money I don't have enough money okay time to zone and make some money so I'm gonna just do the exact same as before have the industrial on the main road have the rest as co residential area boom done Everyone move in, everyone make me money. Make me some money. Make me some money, people. Please, pretty please. I should have done it the other way around. So that 